Hi, this is the Furenalp tour we're going to do. We wanted to do the Serena Pass, only there's too much snow for it to be uh, completely safe. So this is the alternative, it's the beginning of Surenpass, Pass, but you make a big turn back to Engelberg. Down to the elevator station. Yeah, we took the gondola up, like uh, 800 meters, and it's mostly uh, downhill, some hiking path, and uh, the rest is uh, still a surprise for us. Yeah. But the view is quite different, because you're surrounded by big mountains with a lot of waterfalls. Big adventure, let's go. And now the most beautiful part, we can go down. Let's go. When you think these downhills are too technical for you, no worries. It is also possible to do this tour by taking the fire roads. You get the same views, but easier trails. So Jordi, what is with this fence? It's an electric fence, so <laughs> I came with my arm and I hit the brake immediately. <laughs> so exposed on this side, Shock therapy on this side. <laughs> yeah, stay focused. So the trail we just did, really nice. Yeah. Some enduro, yeah, rocky, not that flowy. Uphill a bit, so it's technical. Only it's now uh, Saturday and it's crowded with the hikers. It's a hiking trail, so that's normal. But it was a lot of waiting, yeah. but it was nice anyway. It's uh, worth it. Yep. I think uh, last trail. Yeah. Let's, let's go. Let's go. So this was the Furenalp MTB tour with 20 kilometers and the use of the gondola. It isn't a day trip, but it's a nice one to start or end your day with. It is good to know that the gondola only takes bikes before 9.30 in the morning and after 4 in the afternoon. 
Our tip will be to arrive very early so you stay ahead of all the hikers and enjoy the descents without any interruptions. You can find a link to my Strava for this tour in the description. If you like the video, please leave a like. Consider to subscribe if you want to see more and I'll see you at the next adventure. Ciao!